Welcome to the StatBank, the database service from the Central Statistics Office. In this video, you will learn how to access the StatBank service. On the Central Statistics Office homepage, click on Databases in the blue toolbar towards the top of the page. Click on StatBank, the first item under the CSO Statistical Databases heading. By clicking on the plus or minus signs, you can expand and collapse the theme selections to find the table you require. On the top right of the screen, there is a search box that allows you to search the full database. For instance, if you are interested in getting data on the Live Register, you simply type in Live Register and click Search. The search information box on the top left of the screen will let you know the number of tables returned. We have 19 tables with details of Live Register. You may refine your search using the new search box. For example, type in Social Welfare Office and click on the radio button, search within the results. This shows six tables with Social Welfare Office details. You can also search for the same details through the themes menu. Click on the StatBank link. Expand the Labour Market and Earnings theme by clicking on the plus sign. Expand the Labour Market sub-theme clicking on the plus sign. We now have a list of folders displayed that contain tables. Since we are interested in the Live Register, let's open the first folder, Live Register. Focusing on the key tables, the fifth table listed seems like a likely table of interest. Persons on the Live Register by Social Welfare Office, Sex, Age Group and Month. The text in brackets shows us the time points from which the data is available and when the table was last updated. Please note that you can download the whole data as a PX file by clicking on the download option. To avail of this option, please download PC Access 2008 software, available at this link. Let's click on the title to open this table. Looking at the table details, we have three classification boxes, plus a time dimension box. Please note the help page on StatBank. You can access this by clicking on the question mark icon beside the table title. Let's now look at how to build a table from the information that we are interested in. Looking at the age group classification, the number 3 beside the title indicates there is data about three different types of age groups. To select all three, simply tick on the blue tick sign under the age group header. To deselect, just click on the minus button beside the tick sign. To pick one line, simply click on a single line and it is highlighted straight away. Select the required number of items in each box. Select the months you want to view and then click on the show table icon. The data you selected is presented in a data table. The table can be edited using the Edit Table drop-down menu at the top of the screen. The Pivot drag and drop facility in this drop-down list is very useful to present the data in a different way for printing. By selecting Pivot, Drag and Drop and clicking on the blue arrow, you are presented with the header and stub variables for the table and can simply drag and drop them to view the table differently, as I am now demonstrating. Finally, you can also download the selected data. Use the Download File As drop-down menu at the top of the screen. To select the format of the file you wish to download in, click the blue arrow. You can open to view the file or simply save the file. Hopefully you found this video on StatBank useful and you are now able to select, view and download the data you are looking for on StatBank. Thank you for watching.